hello everyone welcome back to the concept tech this this is the part 8 and uh, this is about the OLEDB destination components so in this we will see how OLEDB destination uh, configure and how we are using this and how we are connecting the source and destinations and uh, how data transferring from and from the source to destination by using the SQL database okay let's start with the pra practicals so I have in a previous lecture I have already configured the my control flow and uh, LEDB source so now in this we will see LEDB destination then you will see the component LEDB destination in a, in a search SSS toolbox where you can find the in uh, other source or LEDB source or you can uh, take this from this destination as assistance so I will use destination as assistance so yeah so this will ask you to configure the connection of the destination but I have already connection then I will click on the OK and still this are in a like a cross means like it's not configured correctly then you have to double click on this yep the dialog box is pop, pop up so it's showing basically this component has no available input column do you want to continue editing the available properties of this component because source right now I I haven't connected the source to destination because of this message is showing okay so let's continue by clicking on the yes yep again this will ask you to select table or view from the list without selecting the table or some anything you you can't be able to connect on the mapping error and uh, anything so first of all you have to select the tables or view so in a data access mode it's provide provide you some multiple steps like a table or view table or view fast load table name and it's there is a one option as well SQL command where you can type the SQL command or you have a prepared already there is any query then you can paste it here and uh, and preview the query else you can select the table from the database yeah so I will select my uh, one table which I have created for the uh, destination this this is the name of the table is desktop unity measures okay and after selecting you can view the existing query or something like uh, how it's serving correctly or not can okay, then close it then mapping you can't be able to map because the source was not connected okay so first I will connect it then you can map it by selecting the table Yep. so it's a table and uh, you can see the preview of the data in that table and you can click on the map then it's uh, automatically get connected with each tab each column and uh, I don't want to set any value for this uh, column so I will leave this as it is and uh, click on the OK yeah the error is gone now let's run the query and see if it's running fine or not yep you can see 30 rows was transferred from the source to destination it means the package is running fine so can see these tapes and progress of all the execution of the package in a progress tab okay and uh, you can see the data it's inserted into this table okay yep. so that's it from the lecture video and uh, if you have any feedback anything then please uh, provide your feedback on a video comments and uh, please share and subscribe thank you thank you so much